Hey y'all, so as you know, I am doing a series on my monthly wrap ups, but I am doing them retroactively. So if you're following me, then you should have seen the June one already posted. That is going to be part one. But today is going to be part two, and we are going to be focusing on the month of May. I read six books in the month of what in the month of May, and so I'm going to be going through exactly what I thought of them using yes, no, or maybe. Are you ready? All right. So starting off with Saint Baptiste Part One by Miss Candace. This one is going to be a maybe for me. Um, it started off pretty good, but the cliffhanger and what was to come, I didn't really know what to expect of the book. So, um, yes, I'm going to go with a maybe, and you will see exactly what I rated part two in the June monthly wrap-up. KC Faces Peer Pressure. I actually really, really like this, and I'm going to tell you if you are a parent of children or if you are someone who does vacation Bible school or if you are a teacher this was actually a really really good book so it has character skills etc in here definitely a yes love loss book one of love's improbable possibility series by love belvin the beginning of asmir and reina's story it is definitely a yes it's a slow burn but for me it is worth it Taming the Wolf by my girl, Maureen Smith. This is Marcus and Samara's story. And yes, it is a definite yes for me. Also introducing the wonderful Asha Dubois. The Wolfpack series is just a classic romance series. On Juneteenth by Annette Gordon-Reed. If you know me, I love her as a historian. This is a definite yes. If you want to learn a little bit more about Juneteenth, especially pertaining to the state of Texas, because that's where it happened. But from an actual Texan, this is going to be the book for you. And as you can see, it's not very long. And then finally, my guy, <laughs> Pastor Ezra Carmichael. Hell yes. <laughs> This is book three of the Bonded with Ezra series. And baby, let me go ahead and tell you, there is nobody, and I mean nobody, who could have written this book as well as Love Belvin did. So this was one of my rereads. I loved, annotated on this, but yes, I love this series. And this is the Love Unaccounted series. So yes, that is going to be my monthly wrap up for the month of May. Let me know if you've read any of those books, if you're interested in them. Love to hear your thoughts. Bye, y'all.